they're quite different. Um, Christine is somebody who uh, is very lost because she wakes up every day and her memories have disappeared overnight. Uh, so really, her, her kind of pain, I suppose, comes from her not understanding who she is and her search for her own identity, for her own sense of self. Um, whereas Julia is um, quite different. She's a photographer um, who is, uh, in, in, in Second Life, is living, is living another life, if you like. She's living in the second stage of her life. So she's somebody whose life used to be coloured by addiction and by danger and... Um, by recklessness, I suppose, but she's now sort of settled down and become somebody different, and she's living quite a comfortable life uh, in London, uh, which is turned upside down, really, when her sister uh, is murdered in an apparently random attack. And the book really is her, her journey uh, to try and work out what happened to her sister, but also to try and uh, reconcile those two elements of her own self. My feeling is it's the job of any writer to think themselves into somebody else's head. Um, and to imagine that they're, they're looking at the world through somebody else's eyes, if you like. So with both of my books, the fact that I was writing from a woman's point of view didn't really seem like that big a deal. Um, I, I suppose it's just about observing people, observing the way that people react, the way that people respond. And I'm very lucky that, you know, I've got a lot of, a lot of my friends are women, uh, a lot of my family <laughs> are women. Uh, so it didn't, it didn't feel like that, that, uh, that much of a task, really. I think if I hadn't become a writer, I probably would have wanted to be a psychologist. <laughs> I'm quite, I am quite interested in the way people's minds work and the way people can be influenced by things that perhaps they're not even necessarily aware of themselves. I'm thinking, I suppose, about the way things in people's past that they feel they've dealt with, that they feel don't affect them, are still in there. Um, I don't know. It's just a fascination I have. You know, I, I, love, I even love doing those endless quizzes you get on Facebook or whatever when you have to say which colour you like and which member of the Beatles you most feel closest to, you know, and it tells you what personality type. I don't believe them all, but I love those kind of uh, psychological questionnaires. So I, I think I'm just interested in what, make, what, what makes people tick, and especially when they're doing bad things. I need to un understand why somebody would do that. It's been options, so um, Warner Brothers are developing it uh, with uh, Reese Witherspoon's company, so that's very exciting. But it's very early days, so we'll see what happens. Mm -hmm.